Now, Consumer 10, a monthly report of the Consumer Price Index giving us a better idea of how much our budgets will be changing. The Labor Department reports an 8.5% jump in March compared to a year earlier. 10 TV's Krista Frost is live now with what this means for our wallets. Krista? Yeah, so we all know that things are costing so much more right now than they did maybe a year or more ago, right? So I've got a box of Frosted Flakes right here. Here's the thing. About a year ago, this cost maybe a couple bucks, right? And now it's not much more, but it is 50 cents more for a box of cereal like this. And if you've got kids at home, you know that this kind of item, it really goes pretty quickly, right? And that 50 cents, it adds up if you're buying that every single week, an item like this. So we do kind of have a breakdown for you for what this actually means when it comes to your budget and grocery shop. Shopping. So here's the thing. The consumer price index does show that there's about 10% of an increase when it comes to your grocery budget. Now, things like bacon and oranges, obviously costing a little bit more, some meats, up 18% in cost. Eggs, up about 13%. Now, of course, gas. That's a story that we all know about a month ago. It was a little more than $4 a gallon. Well, that price, it slowly started to go down, and that could change even more. That's because President Biden had announced using a higher ethanol blend gasoline this summer. Now, that could cost cat, cut costs of gas by 10 cents a gallon, but Biden says he's doing even more with that. And even though E15 is only available in a few thousand pumps today, we're investing more than $100 million to build biofuel infrastructure of the future. Things like blend pump, blender pumps, the gas pumps that can handle higher blends of bioethanol and diesel fuel. Now, when it comes to that higher blend of ethanol in our gas, something that I do want to note is typically that's not allowed. And the reason for that is because it creates more smog in our environment. But that's not the only thing that people should really be concerned about. If you have any sort of a respiratory issue, that could create some issues for you. So just be aware for that this summer when that time comes for that change in gas and something else. Anyone who works outside, also keep that in mind when it comes to your own health and safety. But for now, pointing live in Hilliard, Krista Frost, 10TV News.